One essential material needed for making semiconductors is ultra-pure water. South Korea has been relying on other countries for water-producing equipment, but now Korea is working on ways to produce the ultra-pure water on its own. Tang Taehan tells us more. This is ultra-pure water. While tap water contains natural electrolytes and salts, ultra-pure water contains just H2O and nothing else. Ultra-pure water is needed for making semiconductors as any impurities will cause defects. About one liter of ultra-pure water is used to wash a 12-inch wafer. So as you can imagine, factories need a lot of ultra-pure water. And that is why semiconductor factories have their own water production facilities. South Korea's chipmakers like Samsung Electronics rely on equipment from overseas to make ultra-pure water, and much of that equipment comes from Japan. And as relying on other countries can be risky, South Korea is developing its own domestic technology to produce the water. If there are export regulations in the future, it could be hard to produce ultra-pure water, and that could disrupt semiconductor production. The ultimate goal is to be able to fully produce ultra-pure water domestically by 2025. This will help make South Korea's semiconductor supply chain even more secure. Chang Taehyun, Arirang News.